it's time to play with some makeup. Mm-hmm. Hello and welcome to my channel. Age is just a number and my name is Barbara Jean. This is a channel for women over 40, over 50, over 60, over 70 and beyond who have a love of fashion and beauty. And today it's about beauty. Yes, it is. So if this is a channel that you think that you might enjoy and you haven't subscribed yet, well, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that little red subscribe button down there. And while you're there, hit the little bell next to it. It'll let you know every time I do make another video. And leave me a comment below. I would love for you to introduce yourself and let me know what you think of my content. If you are a returning subscriber, once again, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart that you come and spent a few minutes of your very important day with me. It means the world to me. So today, we're talking about this palette. I went to Ulta. I know. And they had some things on sale. <laughs> so I thought I've never tried this this brand before. So I thought I'd try it and give it a give it a try. Let's see. This is the um, Pure Extreme Visionary Palette. So we're going to test out this little bad boy. So if you want to see how I got this look with this palette hang tight and we're going to get started on it right away so here's the palette oh it's so shiny um it is pure extreme visionary and pure cosmetics uh let's see what does it say it says lift your spirits with this high grade 12 piece eyeshadow palette that features blendable Silky smooth shades that range from beautiful soft pinks to warm peach that complement all skin tones. Featuring a mix of mattes, metallics, pastels, and warm neutral shades for that, that work seamlessly together. The, this ultra creamy palette is infused with hemp seed oil to leave behind a moisture rich, high pigment, irresistible color for a finished look that's dreamy. Well, let's check it out. It has got a nice big mirror. Let's see. I'm trying to see. Beautiful colors in here. All right, so what I've already decided, what I'm going to do is, oh, they have names on them, but it's very hard. Okay, this very light neutral peach right here is called Idealist. So that's what I'm going to start with and do all over my lid. And I'm just using a wide brush here um, just 
just going to brush this on all over kind of like a base i've already primed my eyelid with um, the milani eyeshadow primer in nude and i've already tight lined my upper line with chanel waterproof uh Furlis, f e u i l l e s it's kind of a blackish with a little bit of purple in it maybe no that's cassis this is just kind of a, a a black with a little bit of shimmer in it i think all right so i've done that so the two colors that i am that, that i'm just want to try so bad is this gold shimmer and then this matte burgundy right here and the matte burgundy is called rebel and the gold is called leader so i want a let's see where is my this is sigma blending brush number e25 All right, I'm just going to go straight down into that Rebel, that Burgundy. And start. Applying it a little at a time here. Take a blending brush, just kind of soften those edges up. Go back and get some more. And because of the way this is shaped, that oval shape, I'm not doing it this way. That's what I was doing first. But now I'm going to turn it this way. And I'm going to lay that from the corner of the eye up to where I started to kind of make that backward seven. All right, this is the, like I said, I think in the beginning, this is the first time I've ever tried um, Pure Cosmetics um, anything. <laughs> the thing about being on the, starting my YouTube channel, I'm trying a lot of new things that I really never thought that I would try before. But I still won't try fish. No. All right, I'm going to go back with the blending brush, fluffy blending brush, and I'm going from the outside in. Not my hair, though. So far, I like the formula. of it all right i'm going to do just maybe another round to deepen it up
another round with the blending brush. All right, I like that. So now I'm ready for the gold. <laughs> Go for the gold. <laughs> All right, and sometimes the best way is just your finger. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go, in. oh, it is creamy. It's powdery, but very creamy. I don't know if you can hear my stomach growling or not. <laughs> I had a late breakfast after walking this morning and I thought it would do me till dinner time. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> All right, where's my blending brush? So, um, what I'm going to do is take a smaller targeted paddle brush. I got a new one. Where'd it go? Here it is. Sigma. No, I'm sorry. Sephora Pro. And I'm going to go into that Rebel, that dark color. And I'm going to go back and increase it, the intensity on the outer part. I still want that gold to shine through. All right, where is uh, another? Let's try this paddle brush here. It is a little bit bigger. This is, uh, oh, Japanesque, yes. It's a little bit bigger, smaller than this, but bigger than that. So, all right, I'm gonna go in with, use this for that gold. Because what I'm wanting to do is Take it above the mobile lid a little bit. So when I'm looking straight ahead, of course this is sitting up a little bit. When I'm looking straight ahead, you can see it and it helps your eye to look your eyelid to look a little bit bigger um, when you're fooling it by placing it above where the actual indention is. Very pretty. So I'm gonna use, because this has already got it on here, the small one, I'm gonna go from underneath and rub it into the lash line. And make it connect with the outer edge there. Now, I'm not going to do all the way in because I want to use the gold from the inner to meet in with that. And then just kind of marry, marry, marry it together 
where it comes together there. So the gold just kind of fades into the burgundy. All right, so now I want to use, I'm going to go back, let's see, for the brow part, I'm just going to use, keep it simple, this uh, concealer stick. Just underneath there, and then kind of use my finger to pat it in. Another little bit of blending into there. And I think, where'd it go? I think I may do just a smidgen more higher right there. smidgen and then blend there. all right okay I'm happy with that so I'm going to uh, do the other eye and I'll be right back all right so I've got the both eyes done and um, I'm very happy with this. Let me shut my eyes so you can see to see the gold on there. So um, very simple. The eyeshadows are very, very nice and um, blend very, very nice. This palette is, uh, I'll show you again the colors that I used in um, there. I can get a good angle of them but they're just beautiful and so like I said I've never used uh, uh, pure cosmetics before so I was very very happy with this Andy yeah, I got it for I think it was like 40% off so um, I think I only paid $28 for this palette um, so that was a good good deal at Ulta and it did come with but I forgot all about it it came with a eyeshadow primer sample and I forgot that so I'll have to do that uh, use it uh, use that it's another excuse to do another look and I'm just really uh, some of these here this purple amethyst color well pinkish purple is just lovely and this pink, rosy pink um, just just they're just lovely so yeah so that is um my review on that so i really like this this palette uh i paired it with uh, uh the lip that i used with just a nude lip liner and then i used the um uh, chanel's um it's called mademoiselle 434 and see so if you can see it's kind of a dark mauve so I thought it'd be kind of a good it um, it just kind of goes with everything so I thought it'd be it'd be good with this the I thought I would do here let's try this this is um, Becca's um, it's a glow gloss and it's metallic gold so since I've got gold on my eyelids I thought let's put just a little bit here In the center just a subtle glow just a little bit of a glow right there so all right so I'd love to hear your thoughts on this and tell me have you tried um, per uh, or pure cosmetics and have you uh, have you tried this palette this palette is really very nice so I may have to check out some of their other palettes so if you have tried some of their other palettes and there's one you think I need to try let me know down below so, all right, I'm going to sign off here, ladies. All right, so I'm going to tell you what I tell you every single day. You know, ladies, get up and show up because you are worth it.
So until I see you in my next video, have a very safe and a blessed day.